major things have happened And a white boy like me black On the track I'm going bad again <laughs> Got a baddie and she going ready What's going on guys, Fell Plays here, and today we're going to be playing this Pokemon Ultra Moon Let's Play. In the last episode, we took on the final trial of the, I don't know what it's called, Grand Trial? It's called the Grand Trial? Yeah, I think it is called the Grand Trial. Uh, but we took on the Grand Trial of the Alola region, and we got uh, told to go down to the Aether Paradise, or whatever this thing is called down here. But, I don't know if I boxed my mods. Okay, yeah, I did. Uh, but we have everybody still from the last episode. Everything is perfectly fine, but let's head down over here. Yo, what is that? Is that supposed to be a... Okay, that's a rock roof. I was wondering what that was. Uh, but what's over here? Is this her little... Oh. Hold on, we gotta... What is over here? What is this? What is this? Yo, it's a big mushroom! We want the shrooms! We want the shrooms, boys! Just kidding, we don't want shrooms. We do not want shrooms. We do not want shrooms. There was another sticker somewhere over here. There it is. There's another sticker. Now we got 20 of them bitches. Professor Oak wants to talk to you. Oh, well, hello there. It's me, Samson Oak. I've come stop by the Hia Hia Beach. The Hia Hia Beach. Well, I guess we can go by there. I know where Hia Hia is. We're right in here, here, city. Uh, let's go by the beach. Come on. Am I in the right area? No. Where is Samson? There you are. Oh, young brass. I've been one. I hope to see you again. It seems you collected 20 totem stickers. I'll give you a special eradicate. That's as big as a real totem eradicate once you get 20. What? 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 Let's check out what type of Pokemon it is. Yo, that thing is massive. Um, I'm gonna name it Nuts. And I purposely misspelled that. Nuts. I wanna see this thing! Um, the. Okay, searching for them. Uh, you collected 20. So all we had to get was 20? So technically, that was a gift Pokemon. That is a gift Pokemon for us. So if we were Nuzlocking, I would rather just. But let's look at nuts. Oh my gosh! That thing is big! Oh my god! That is huge! I'm gonna have to take this into battle for a sec. Hold on. Damn it, can we not surf over here? Oh, wait, wait. What's this? To a boy or girl who is reading this, please take care of this letter and give it to the person who loves dancing and Corsola lives on a cow island. She should be singing the song she wrote together with Corsola. I bet she is. If you give this letter to her, I promise good things will happen to you. Where would this person be? What? There's another item. There's Soda Pop. That's interesting. Is it you? <clears throat> okay. Irrelevant. Hmm. Oh, oh. Hold on. We needed that. <laughs> I'm so addicted to these damn uh, totem stickers now. 
Cause you know they're like, all right. Nope. Irrelevant. Okay. But I wanted to take this thing into a battle. Uh, if I find something, I will. See, I need it. A wedding's about to start. Will you celebrate? Okay, let's go. Let's celebrate a wedding. Here they come, the bride and the groom. Oh my gosh! It's a Pikachu. Here comes the bride. Here comes the bride. Here comes the bride. Ooh, bumba. Pikachu! Pikachu! So right. So beautiful, right, honey? Always be nice to each other. Ah, oh, well, you may have kissed the bride. Oh my gosh. Are they gonna shock? Pika. Cute! Oh my gosh, that's great. Congratulations. Yay, that was perfect. That was our little play wedding. Here's the way. Uh, thanks for celebrating with us. Okay. Uh, yay, the Pelipper's flying. Do you think that Pelipper's wild? I think that all Pelipper's are wild. You know, I think that Pelipper's are the best Pokemon in the whole entire nation, you know? Alola. I need to find an area for that damn... What is this? There's my totem sticker. We already got 22 of them bitches. Okay. What's over here? I'm a real man. Uh... Wait, we can swim in the water? Because I kind of want to try to get some... I want to see what nuts looks like outside. Because that is insane. That is an insane... That's a die ball. That's nice that I saw that. Dude, let's battle! The best thing about Swinner is there's nothing... I just want to see what this thing looks like in battle. Yo, I look like that without my shirt on. That's literally me. Like, I should just make that my profile picture. Oh my god, that thing is... So fat. It's almost as big as that fucking Gyarados. Jesus. It's just got body by a Gyarados almost. Oh my god. That is so powerful. That is so powerful. Okay, Flappy, you got this. You got this, Flappy. Why did this thing go thrash out of all moves? You got static too, dude. My dude! That thing was fat! But we're not keeping it on the team, just letting you guys know. I just wanted to see what it looked like. Now, if it's one of those Marowax, we might end up putting it on the team. I don't know. I mean, I don't think we're going to get a Marowak. It would be nice. Well, let's head back up. Let's head back upstream. Let's jump down here. What you got to do? Uh, Pukumuku Chunker? I'm not going to become a Pukumuku Chunker. Turn to it. Oh, look at it. Uh, play peekaboo with it. We can play peekaboo with more. Turn it 
turn to the left. Here, why don't you take this? See, here I was thinking that we could get one of those sandy gas. Actually, a sandy gas would not be a bad encounter. I don't know what sandy gas is in cap. Okay, I do not want to get a fucking. No. No. You know, nuts. You... I don't think nuts can actually take this thing out. This. What is with this game? You can't avoid anything. Okay. Let's go. Let's see if that thing kills. Let me set my phone over here. <laughs> okay. Well, I think that's a pretty dang good, uh... Exploring really quickly. Uh, oh, gotta get that. Uh, I'm just checking something really quickly. Just give me a second. We're uh... okay. Hano Grand Resort. Uh, what? Ah, uh, you are. Aren't you famous? You're the famous Chester. Chew? Chew. You've become a household name with the massive success of your film, latest film, Chester. So you, the rumors were true that you were in a little apple. Uh, what? I must ask you to respect Master Chester's privacy and little me and, and oh what but everyone is dying to know more about the ch famous Chester's private light life uh, you got a spill please miss we've already asked once nicely shoo step in you want an interview too this is my scoop I'm not letting you have it damn everybody just wants to battle in this game I like how they added that though, it's nice. It's interesting, I should say. If this Pikachu is the Pikachu that we're supposed to be gifted, I will flip because I will box that Flaffy right away, you hear me? Catch this! Dying. Dying. I work all next week. I'm a wee tired as a motherfucker. Oh! Our Flappy Vaults! Right when I say that! It's like, oh, you're gonna replace me. Um. Hell no. We aren't gonna replace you, we're just not impressed. <laughs> but now we got a mega potentially, that's a mega right there. Ampharos will be added to the Pokedex. I mean, if we want to, we can pick up Loxes again, but I don't know right now. That's nice, we have a whole entire Flappy line. Okay, let's see if he's trying to learn anything. Anything you want to learn? Thunder Punch! Yes! Uh, I think you're more of a physical attacker, if I'm correct. In this game, at least. I think you can run a... You can run a physical Ampharos. It's possible. It's just... It's not the favorite. Wow, but I want the freedom of the press. Thank you for helping us out, either in a sicky situation. Chill. 
Oh, it seems... It's here? What, are you sure if you insist? Please use it wisely. Choo choo. Oh, that is the Pikachu Museum pose. If only I had a Pikachu! If only I had one. If only I had one. We might have to take a trip down to Mele Mele. Just saying, guys. We might have to take a trip down to Mele Mele for that. But let's head down here. Let's head in here. Okay. Hold on. Hold on. We're gonna we're gonna bring that up. So you couldn't last. Ah, but forgive me, I haven't introduced myself. Call me Faba. I told you before that I would show you some place astounding, right? Well, that was wondrous place was Aether Paradise. Let me tell you about Aether Paradise. It's just a, as the name suggests, Aether Paradise is a veritable place that for Pokemon that float very far out in the sea surrounding Lola. It is an artificial island that it made entirely by human technology for the protecting of Pokemon. Of course, I'm an adult who keeps his promises, so I will show you all that all I've told you is the absolute truth with the tour of Aether Paradise. Will you come with me? Cool. Good, good. Then you'll come with me. Aether Paradise will be amazing. Amaze you. Wait, take me too. Oh, even the Kuna ha Olivia has come to set you off. As a Kuna, I look at it, all the trial goes as my, uh, my own children. Now I've got... Not that I've got any, but I've never gotten even married. Listen up, you two. Your greatest opponent is about always yourself. Your greatest allies are the Pokemon beside you. Are you coming too, Professor? I've got my own business to attend to. You go and s you s go see the ma- Okay. Uh, yo, yo, yeah. Well, let's make it up on Mally Garden. Yep, it's a goodbye. A call the island. Though, I guess we can come back anytime we want to, huh? That it lit- Then let us adventure- Okay, cool. Let's go! Yo, I like their ship. I like their ship more than my ship. Can you believe that we're about a, a big hunk of iron like Aether Paradise can float in the sea? And it's all because Pokemon are holding up. Did you know that, Bryce? I already knew that. Oh, I can't wait to see my see inside Aether Paradise for myself. Well, I've already seen an Aether. And there, now we're going to Aether. And then, is Yula the one over there, this way? They have this island situation weird. It's weird. But I like it. Aether Paradise. There we go. What is that pseudo Wudo doing there? Huh, here you two. Here we are, you two. This is Aether Paradise. They're so happy to be transported. Hmm. Aether Paradise is a facility created to, um, for the conservation of Pokemon. It has also been outfitted with all the latest technology for this purpose. Downstairs are team works on developing new Pokeballs and more. Yes, and for all the sake of Pokemon conservation, though you will not be able to use any of your Pokeballs within Aether Paradise. Uh, a jamming signal is broadcasting throughout the facility to prevent this function. Excuse me, Mr. Faba. Yes, excuse you. 
What's the meaning of that form of dress? I have a title for a reason. How else would anyone know how important I am? Yes, Branch Chief Ch Fava. Now, I must go in with the president to speak about, uh, uh, show these children around, and then take them to meet the president as well. I cannot speak today. <laughs> okay. Phew. Hey there, Wiki. Welcome to Eight to Paradise, Breast Now. My name is Wiki. Nice to meet you. Oh, I should have said Alola. Wait. You know who they we are? How'd you know that? One of our employees told me about your meeting on a, a call island, and of course I heard about how you helped protect the Pokemon there. Too, young Hal. Thank you very much. Let me show you around. The main entrance is up ahead of us. Okay, let's go. Well. Here's a button. Let's push it. Yeah. Dang. This is the main entrance. You have to have your Pokemon taken care of at the recession zest if they need it. Look at the little stew fighter. You and Hal are both. Are you hoping to become champions? You must be around 11 then. I'm not 11. Yeah, I am, I guess. Yeah, I took the first challenge chance I had to jump to the once I turned 11. Because someday I really want to become able to be strong, beat my grandpa, he's super strong, and I want to beat the island challenge. Cool. I suppose all children must yearn to take their island challenge, their journey of their own choosing when they get. Uh, 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 uh. Okay, here's the button. Let's push it. Let's push it. Push that button. Guys, it's 420. Holy shit. Enterprise says has a safe haven for all Pokemon. This is why we use Pokeballs. It's for strictly forbidden within the area. Wow. We keep all Pokemon in that have been targeted by Team Skull here and we also try to support Pokemon that need other extra production protection like Corsola and for Mini. I hope you don't mind if I read a passage from my old Pokedex. I traveled through Kanto before when I was younger, you see. Corsola and Alola where their natural enemies Marini are plentiful. Many Corsola have stubby branches on their head. Yeah, my Gramps is always saying that nature's got a cruel side and gives us blessings. But can Aether, Fair to, uh, Aether Foundation really protect all the Pokemon that are out there? Nature doesn't does have its own balance, of course. It can be difficult to judge just how much we humans could, should try to affect that. Can it? That's pretty amazing. The Aether Fair Foundation seems awesome. And but why? You bother setting up a branch to like this place in Alola. I couldn't say. It's hard to know what our president was thinking sometimes. If you like to meet Luce Mean, she's up here in the conservation area right now. Well, I think we should meet Luce Mean in the next episode. So if you guys did enjoy today's episode and y'all want to see more of Pokemon Ultra Moon, make sure to smash the link below and make sure to like, comment, and subscribe for more daily content. And with that, I'm gonna get the heck out of here. I'm Foul Plays, and I'm out.